What's shaking, Tabonians? Magnilla Q here with some more gameplay of the jump scare horror game Outlast. If you haven't watched the first part of this series, I highly recommend that you go back and check that one out and enjoy the the few moments that Magnilla Q had the poop scared out of him. Um, but anyway, as uh, in keeping with the spirit of series, this uh, video will be part two of the Outlast gameplay on the Xbox One. So let's go ahead and get back into the story and see if we can get the poop scared out of us some more. Uh, and if you like this video, be sure to leave a like, be sure to comment, and be sure to subscribe uh, to make sure that you stay up to date with all of Magnilicu's gameplay videos. All right, let's go ahead and get started. So I left off where I was in the locker and some big crazy dude uh, ripped off my arm and killed me and then I you know, restarted the game and saved him while I was in the locker. Okay, so I need to get back in the locker again because he's coming. Yep, and so he's going to tear down the door. Shh. There he is. Shh. There he is. You are here, aren't you? In a pig. I'll find out how you lose. Okay, so he didn't find me. Don't do anything just yet, my Nelly Q. Just hang on. Okay, so he's going that way. door he went into, but I don't want to meet him again. Okay, so he shut the door, so I'm assuming since he didn't go, or since this door is still open, he did not go in this one. Gently close the door, my name is Gosh dang it. You need to work on your heavy handedness. Okay, what have we got here? Head on backwards. Nice. And some more documents. Big fucking guy. Yeah. The big fucker stalking me. Found a patient file for Chris Walker, ex military police, several tours in Afghanistan. A lot of blood in this place on, is on his hands, but not all of it. Okay. Dear sirs, the full report pending, no immediate action is required on the part of the Murkoff Corp. The profit potential of Project Wallrider remains staggeringly, staggeringly high. The four fatalities contain enough ambitious, ambi ambiguous uh, data to make any litigation if evidence is correctly managed impossible. Project Wallrider remains a dangerous initiative and there will almost certainly be further casualties as with the others. However, family and government interest in the patients is so low as, they, as to make any chance of legal actions vanishingly unlikely. Violence among patients is increasing as the morphogenic engine therapy gets closer to producing working models, but a combination of physical and chemical restraints has proven sufficiently effective to ensure contained control and profit. Respectfully, Helen Grant, Murkoff Legal Mitigation Department. Now, in the last video, I literally pooped myself four times. Okay, so it is now uh, t nine, f seven, five after, no, oh, four after nine in this video. Okay. We're supposed to open the door. 
more gently. Okay, close the door. Gently. Gosh dang it, my Nilly Q. Slamming doors is going to get us found. Okay, hopefully the big fucker's in there and he stays in there. Okay, I just went in there and came out there. Okay, so I don't know where to go now. witness right here, right? Yeah, poor witness. Okay. Well, let's try and go downstairs. And the door is open. Yep. going to be something there to jump out at. Okay, so let's read this one and find out what we got. So that notes and documents. On Wednesday 10, February 1954, hypnotic experiment and research work was contained in Building 13 of Mount Massive Preserve in Colorado. Using the following subjects, material abridged. Ace. Post hypnotic of night of the night pointed finger you will sleep was enacted. Mrs. Jackson and Pierce merely progressed to a deep hypnotic state with no further suggestion. Miss Pierce was then instructed, having previously expressed a fear of firearms in any fashion, that she would use every method at her disposal to awaken Miss Jackson. Now in a deep hypnotic sleep, and failing this, she would pick up a nearby pistol and fire it at Miss Jackson. She was instructed that her rage would be so great that she would not hesitate to kill Jackson for falling, failing to awake. Miss Pierce carried out these suggestions to the letter, including firing the unloaded pneumatic pistol gun at Jackson and then her, and then proceeding to fail, fall into a deep sleep. After proper suggestions were made, both were awakened and expressed complete amnesia for the entire sequence. Miss Pierce was again handed the gun, which she refused in an awkward state to pick up or accept from the operator. She expressed absolute denial about the foregoing sequence. Okay, so they're conducting some strange mental type experiments. It's just my hand. batteries here. Default press anal towards Who's there? Who's there? Who's there? Nobody. Don't you worry about it. like a dude sitting there, but apparently it's just a machine. Okay. I tell you, the music and the lighting is just intensifying the creep factor to a bazillion. I am definitely on the edge of my seat. Any preparation to jump. I just know there's gonna be something. Okay, so we have decapitated bodies hanging upside down in some kind of a maintenance garage shelter building. I'm not quite sure what this thing is, but there's three doors. 
and something here in the middle. Turn on the gas pump. Turn on two gas pumps and the main breaker to restart the generator. Okay. Two gas pumps and so where are the gas pumps? sure what to do but apparently I'm not supposed to die ass on out of this room so I can get out. This is definitely a hor uh, horror survival. Okay, there's no protection protecting yourself here. You have to run and hide. All that I have is a camera. But at least it's an HD camera, right? Okay. I need those. Okay, let's 
Let's get in here just for a second. Okay. Well, the music just intensified, so I don't know what's going on. I don't know if it's safe to come out. Let's go ahead and save the game. Okay. And let's go ahead and step out. Now we have to turn on the gas, was it? something on. God, that creeped me out. More batteries. Yes, please. More heads. Body parts. By the way, this is not me breathing. This is my character. <laughs> uh oh, he's in this room. Oh God! I'm literally holding my breath. Oh God! Okay, I think he's gone. Step out. Okay. Yeah, we have to turn something off. Okay. 
hell out of here. Uh, dude. There is no locker. Yes, there is. so I can get out. Count to five. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. now or three times and I have to go do it all over again don't I oh god okay Quickly, hopefully I can get through this level really quick. Uh, like I said, I'm not the best player, and this is a brand new game I've never played before, so uh, we're learning together as we play. And that creepy dude with the stick is right there, so hopefully this will go pretty quick.
crap. Okay. down there, dude. Good God. Now. Uh. Oh, yeah, there's no door. Uh oh. I think I heard the big... I'm running very low on batteries and I missed some batteries. Check my documents. Yes, I still have my document. Okay. I hear his footsteps. I think I'm not claustrophobic. So, I really don't know where to go now. Uh, do we call the elevator again? No, but we knocked another dude off. can't go that way. Let's change batteries for the level of feet. Do I go this way? No, I cannot. So which way do I go? Sorry guys, I'm lost. I don't know what to do here. So, stay with me. Hopefully we'll figure this out. I've already been in there. Is this one open now? Nope. Not this one. Okay, I haven't been in here yet. Yeah, I have. It's just the other door. Try that one, can't go that way. Well, this corridor is empty. I don't think there's anything hidden. Can't open that door. Nothing there. So a headless dude and another headless dude. So, let's check. Let's 
Let's go ahead and turn our light off and check our... Well, let's save it first. Uh, select save spot. Yeah, we'll save it there, why not? Okay. Well, um... Can't go upstairs. Let's go back there. Or not. We haven't been in here yet, have we? This room doesn't look familiar. Okay, so I guess we do go this way. Nope, we can't. Okay, change batteries again. I don't know how many batteries I have. Um, I've got five, I guess. Okay, so I can't get back in there. What the heck? I think we have to go back downstairs. We really do. No, no, let's go back downstairs. Back in business. trying to get the story out through me. Well, we made it through that part of the video, finally. Let's play a little bit longer here. Great, looks like I'm in a padded cell. 
and my vision's still blurry. But hey, I got my camera still. Rest in peace. Remember that notes are only added to your notebook when you can quarters raise to report events. Apparently I'm supposed to record something here. Interesting. Alright, well let's go ahead and hide. Save the game. And end the video for now. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. And I hope you enjoyed the Outlast gameplay so far. And like I said, this is a brand new game I've never played before. So there's going to be a lot of trial and error. And we're going to have to find our way through together. So stay with me. Be patient. And be prepared to get the crap scared out of you. This time around, it wasn't so scary, um, except for that last guy, the inmate that injected me with some kind of chemical that knocked me out. But anyway, other than that, it really wasn't too scary. So, uh, if you liked this gameplay, be sure to like the video. If you enjoyed it, leave a comment. And also be sure to subscribe to stay tuned to more gameplay from MagnoliQ. So as always, this is just an old guy trying to prove that next-gen gaming is not for the next generation, but can still be enjoyable for older generations like me. So I am prevailing to confirm that gaming is about having fun and not always being the best. And as you've seen, this gameplay I did not do the best, but I still had fun. Alright, so also be sure to check out the links posted in the description below to find the tutorials, music, software, plugins, equipment list, and the inspiration that encouraged this video, previous videos, and all of my future videos. Again, thanks for watching, and remember to like the, like the video, leave a comment, let me know what you liked about it, let me know what you didn't like about it, and be sure to subscribe to my channel. And I hope to see you in the next video, so stay tuned for more gameplay with MagniliQ. Until next time, MagniliQ, signing off. Every step that you